The added security is visible here at Fruit Cove Middle School. Take a look just at the front of the school. You can see multiple St. Johns County Sheriff's deputies cars here. Parents tell us they're still concerned though about this post. I was shocked, totally shocked and considered not sending the kids to school. Carla Compton's reaction is the same many Fruit Cove Middle School parents had when they heard about the threat a student posted on Instagram. We're always concerned about our safety for our kids. The alarming post was a photo of a gun, ammunition, and the message, stay home from school tomorrow. Action News Jacks obtained this statement from the school's principal, Kelly Jacobson, saying the threat is not credible, but the school will have added law enforcement on campus. Compton tells me the added security is one of the main reasons she didn't keep her children home. Thought about it, we talked about it as a family, and decided to bring them to school. According to the principal, the student will face consequences for the post. Parents tell me the threat has prompted discussion about the proper use of social media. Watch what they do and think about the uh, what could happen if you put the wrong post out there. So they're they're pretty pretty much monitored all the time. My children are 11 and we limit social media. The principal here at Fruit Cove Middle School tells us that the student who made this threatening post on social media will face consequences. Reporting in St. Johns County, Beth Russo, CBS 47 Action News Jacks.